In this video we're going to stereotactically align our MRI. Um, so to do that we're going to use a new module called the markups module and you can find that in the all modules drop down markups. We're going to create a new markups fiducial list and then we're going to go into the coronal view for now and look for the ear bars or the ear canals more specifically. Uh, and this and this uh, MRI have everything's pretty well aligned. The ear bars are pretty centered in the ear canal, so I'm just going to use the ear bars as my uh, locations for the fiducials. Uh, and another helpful thing we can do now is by holding the shift key and moving my mouse over one of the views, I can change the other two views to show where my mouse is in that space. So if I hover over the tip of this uh, fiducial ear bar, you'll see that I can see it in the sagittal view, which is another point of reference. Uh, so now what we're going to do is go up to here to this fiducial button, click that, and I'm going to place the fiducial at the tip of that uh, ear bar. You'll see in the sagittal view it's a little bit off, so I'm going to go ahead and drag it more towards the center, double check here, and it all looks good. Um, now I'm going to hit the lock button here, and this makes it so I can no longer drag this fiducial. It's locked. Uh, I'm going to do the same thing for the other side. I'm going to again find the center of the ear bar and then double check it against the sagittal view. Um, because this view is now centered on the first fiducial we placed, but I want to look at this slice in this window, we can again use the shift key to move around or you can uh, right click on the fiducial that you want to jump to and click jump slices. And this will adjust all three views to be centered around that fiducial. So I'm just going to adjust it a little bit more there and again lock it. Uh, now we're going to do the same thing for the eye bars. Uh, the eye bars can be a little bit trickier. So here we can see the outline of the eye bar. What I'm going to do is scroll back and forth until I find the center of that eye bar. Again, fiducial. I'm going to place it at the top of that bony ridge, lock it, and then go to the other side. Use the eye bar, find the center of it by scrolling back and forth, and then fiducial at the top of that bony ridge, lock it. <coughs> we can now go to the advanced drop down here, scroll down once again to fiducial projection, scroll down, and we're going to turn on the 2G projection eye, and this will make it so that all the fiducials are visible through all slices. Uh, they're a little bit small there, so you can adjust the glyph scale, make them a little bit bigger, 